day, good day. Reza, Hytham says you have an old piece of writing from the early Hidden Ones. Oh, that old scrap? Yes, it's just a short letter from one Hidden One to another. One of my rarest artifacts. How did it find its way to you? A friend gave it to me for safekeeping. Bayek was his name. Egyptian fellow. Very kind. Haven't seen him in a long time. A very long time. Anyway, the letter is written in Demotic, so it may not mean much to you, but you're free to have a look. A warning, my beloved. I have heard numerous tales now of a secret codex circulating among the acolytes of our bureaus, both within and without the Empire of Augustus, called the Magus Codex. It names you directly as one of the founders of the Hidden Ones, apart from putting your life in danger. It flies in the face of what we have tried to achieve with our brotherhood. We are justice seekers who shun the light of praise for our good works and who must live in the shadows of our triumphs. Should you see any pages of this Codex, I advise you to destroy them. Keep the dream of our Hidden Ones alive. Now, oh, I am not so naive to think this will be a simple task. Few men and women are suited to keeping such secrets for so long. And it may be that we will fail in the end, but we will have failed in the name of righteousness. Take care, my love. My Iset. My Northern Star. Even in my waning years, I am ever your Osiris. Let our Horus live on beyond us. I think of you often, my jewel. At sunrise and twilight. At new moon and full. When the rain falls and the breath of a moon rides across my neck. I remember you kissing me. Just there. And I will take that feeling to my tomb. To go. Then go in peace.
deep into Alfred's heartland. I hope Guthrum has a sound plan. Strange to see Norris and Flex and Banners flying side by side. I should find them. Eivor! You come at Guthrum's call. It is good to see you. And you, Soma. There is an uneasy peace here. Both armies with their hackles up. Was blood spilt? No. We took Werum without resistance. These Saxons accompany their lord as we stand beside Guthrum. So this board is not the sum of his ambitions. Guthrum's plan is to bring the Saxons to the table. If he can win the peace without a fight, he will do so. And how likely is that? Just now they sit on their thumbs in the church, talking in circles. Come, I will take you to him. Who is Guthrum meeting here? Said Alfred. That's right. The King of the West Saxons has agreed to negotiate. Seems we have him on the back foot. Guthrum should be careful. Alfred speaks with Loki's tongue. Guthrum is not a babe at teat, Eivor. Nor is Alfred. If he has come, it is for his own advantage. Then give us counsel. Stand by Guthrum, show our strength. The King of Hayseeds will soon be humbled, trust me. We took this town as if it were a straw hall. Do not challenge me, Elf King. Your show of swagger and strength has my attention, Guthrum. But we agreed on terms. What more do you want? The crown of Wessex. Wessex has a king. And that king has the backing of the Almighty. Yours is a fever dream, Dane. Guthrum does not negotiate with oathbreakers, men whose words are only shadows of their faults. Ah, Eivor. Our blunted tool returns, Lord. I have given you all I care to, a Dane geld to leave Wareham. You swore an oath upon the cross and that pagan hammer. And when you scurry back to whatever shit-soaked hovel you crawled from, we will release your men. Speak again, handmaid, and I will feed your tongue to Eivor's raven. A fair trade. We already have your cock. Are we done with this pissing contest? If Guthrum has given you his word, then he will honor it. We will leave this town. You have one day. Do not test the king's patience further, or our men will return to Wareham with force. And if you doubt my conviction, know that the Avon River near Uffentune runs red with the blood of your countrymen. Their commander, what did his men cry as he fell? Ula? Uba? Yes, that was it. Remember, you have taken my silver. In return, I expect your honor. I will await news of your retreat in Chippenham. Uber dead? It cannot be. Gods, I will tear that Saxon skin from his bones if this is true. Alfred hisses with a snake tongue, but he gains nothing from this lie. When news of this spreads through the camp, no Saxon will survive the day. You swore upon the cross. Oh, I have no intention of cowing to that milk sack. Now more than ever, I will take his throne and his head. In Winchester, Alfred used me as a tool and cast me aside. So let the betrayer be betrayed. We will burn this village to the ground. After that, we take care of Alfred. Burn where I'm to the ground! Make it a Saxon fire! You all freakers! Destroy everything! The 
Should find Soma. They are not for sure us when they have fires to quell. Stand firm, all! Do not lose your nerve! This place is routed, Soma. Good work. We leave now. There are forest rooms east of us along the road. Come on, men! Move! Stop <laughs> down! They won't let us lose! <laughs> Keep moving! The ruins are close! Keep moving! More Saxons! Draw your weapons! to meet their maker! We can rest here a moment. Now, tell me what you know of that breaker of rings. Weak and wretched troll. Alfred is a wily fox. 
He appears frail, but draws upon an inner strength. It'll not be easy to oust. Fury will fuel my army and my claim. It will not be enough. You must find a weakness. Yes. That is why I called you here. Do you balk at the opportunity to bury the Saxon king? I must first hear a plan to balk at. Hmm. Alfred spoke of Chippenham, a squat hovel of sheep and peasants. So why does he go there and not to Winchester? Your scouts must know they're the best in England. A holiday feast. Their Saxon Christ mass. Alfred will warm his heels by the fire, while Uba lies cold in an English field. I have called upon my allies to join us in this fight. But I must know where to send them. Is Chippenham our final prize? It is. But uh, I will need my men for the coming fight as well. The hostages Alfred took. If there is a chance to save them... You will not lose more friends today. Where are they held? A place further ahead through this forest. They call it Hampton Blockade. Soma, ride north to the Thames and lead my allies south. They should be gathered by now. I will. Gather on the river passing Chippenham. The rest of you set up camp there. I called you Raven Feeder once. At Porchester, you were as hot headed as Thor. You have become a true leader, Eivor. There is much to come, Guthrum, before we can rest with mead in our hands and songs in our ears. I will crush Alfred's skull with my bare hands if Uba is dead. We cannot dwell on this, even if it's true. If you want the throne, only strategy will deliver it. Or bloody wrath will steal it. I will follow this Alfred, hound his heels. Revenge burns within me. A wise man once told me, we do not dash ourselves against hopeless courses. We arrive unexpected, strike swift. You turn my words against me now, Wolfkist. I took them to heart in my darkest times, my friend. And Sigurd? He is back with you? My brother's story is a long one, and for another time. Ridding the land of a strong ruler will make Wessex harder to tame. You almost sound like you respect him, Eivor. I have come to understand the trials of leadership, Guthrum. It is hard not to, when you cradle something as fragile as life within your hands.
there. This is the blockade. The hostages must be in these buildings. What is your plan? We can tread quietly so as not to alert the guards. But I can raid this place in moments with my crew. I will follow your lead. This area is of... Do you think he kept his word? He swore he would not kill them. I cannot say for certain. Just hope we find them soon. What's this? I had to hand them over. Alfred demanded it. We will save them, Guthrum. Stay calm. Slashed and disemboweled by sharp weapons. Saxon blade from the look of it. These are my men. I told you Guthrum wouldn't leave us here to rot.
Go to the camp near Chippenham. Find your countrymen there. Good. We'll pay back the Saxons for the insults they heaped on us. Uthram, some of your men. We will not be feasting in Odin's Hall tonight, boys. Are you Guthrum's men? Aye. Free us and we will fight by your side. Yeah. By Thor, thank you, my friend. Every Saxon who spat at me will die. We'll have your chance, but don't be foolhardy. Let your steps take you far from here to our camp near Chippenham. Thank you, Eivor. You did a great deed here. Their families will raise a cup to you. I need no thanks, Guthrum. Let us speak more when we are safely away. We're safe here. Let us speak, Guthrum. You should join your people at the camp. Even a surprise takes preparation. Your bravery, your leadership, Eivor. You wear it well. You have grown much since last we spoke. You judged me fairly, Guthrum. Harsh, though your words were. But I do not make the same mistake twice. How is your brother, Sigurd? He lives. A changed man. But he is free of Fulke's torment. That at least was a deed well done. Will this all be worth it in the end? Everything we have done? Everything we have sacrificed to win this land? Sometimes I dream of soothe black furrowed earth. And blood seeping from seedlings. Poisoning our future. We must believe our way of life will survive. Our fates are woven. But our deeds forge our destiny. Ah, and so to our final battle. We will wait for you at the camp. West of Arfentune. I fear the worst, but I must know. Yeah. <laughs> 